OK, this is just a very quick show and tell. This one is just to give you a quick peek at one of my favourite moments in the peg figure building process, and that's the actual completion. I love this bit, where I remove the finished character from its painting stand. It just feels so satisfying. I mount my peg figures on these little stands as they provide a useful means for holding the model during the painting process. I've tried specialised figure painting grips like this Citadel one, but they have a couple of disadvantages. Firstly, they're fairly expensive, which means they're a bit impractical if you have multiple figures to work on at the same time. And secondly, while my MDF discs do fit in the grip, they don't stay gripped very securely and occasionally just pop out, which is really annoying. So I started using these very cheap plastic shot glasses, which are buying packs of about 20 from my local pound store. To begin with, I fixed the peg figure to the shot glass using blue tack. But that turned out to be not secure enough either, as blue tack tends to lose its tack after a while. So now I just glue the figure base to the glass itself. I use school glue as it's not a permanent adhesive and is easily removed, but it still sticks the peg figure to the shot glass securely enough for me to grip the model with confidence. The only downside of using these little glasses is that they're made from plastic and ecologically they aren't the greenest of options. Next year I intend to buy a small modelling lathe and will turn myself a set of reusable wooden painting stands to replace these plastic ones. Once the painting of the figure is done and I have varnished the model, I simply remove the stand by running a craft knife between the stand and the base. And voila, one completed figure. Cheers for watching.